wanted to show you a quick, uh, quick uh, demonstration here, making a balsamic garlic onion squash reduction to be served with a stuffed chicken breast tonight. And I wanted to show you uh, one of my favorite tools here. First, we're using the uh, Kasumi titanium, titanium knife. Butternut squash here. I'm going to be using this ceramic little maybe baby mandolin. A couple of quick slices. Things beautiful. Fast. Okay. Got this squash. I'm just going to give a little bit of a rough rough chop. Here we go. Now what I wanted to show you today was this stainless steel prep scoop. This is the fastest way to get the food from your counter over to the frying pan. Fast, no mess, holds about three cups and we're gonna move it right over here to the frying pan. A little olive oil. It's nice and hot. Got some garlic. And the scoop. Onions. Right to the pan. Fast, efficient. You don't, you don't lose any. Let this caramelize a little bit. Okay, adding the butternut squash. A little stir. Let this cook and reduce down. Adding a little bit of fresh ground sea salt. Oh, yeah. A little bit of Tricolor pepper blend, black, pink, and green. And fresh ground pepper is wonderful stuff. I tell you, you never get enough of that. Some more olive oil. Okay, when this gets a nice color to it, just like that, I'll be adding some balsamic vinegar. Doesn't matter what you use, I like this uh, 12 year old from Maldina. The good stuff, the real stuff. And that's all we need, right there. A quick balsamic reduction. Let this get a little bit thicker. About the thickness of syrup. Some people add a touch of sugar. You can put a little sugar if you like. It doesn't really matter. This balsamic's sweet enough. So it's getting thick already. That's it. Flame off, we're done. It's a balsamic reduction. It's going to be going over a stuffed chicken later. Main thing is I wanted to show you this uh, cool tool, the prep scoop. You can pick one up on the website. And uh, I tell you, I really like these high heat spatulas too. There's a spoonula right here. And uh, th these are made in the USA. So quality is unbeatable and it's an everyday tool. And uh, I got to mention also the Swiss diamond cookware. Anything from Switzerland, Look for the little Swiss emblem on there. There's uh, thousands of diamonds on there. The nonstick coating is amazing. And all you do is give it a rinse and it's clean. So that's it. Uh, I'll be back with you soon with another video. Have a wonderful day.